John Gill's Exposition of the Bible Text Now these are the judgments which thou shalt set before them. Exodus 21 1 Commentary Now these are the judgments. The judicial laws respecting the civil state of the people of Israel, so called because they are founded on justice and equity, and are according to the judgment of God, whose judgment is according to truth, and because they are such by which the commonwealth of Israel was to be judged or governed, and were to be the rule of their conduct to one another, and a rule of judgment to their judges in the execution of judgment and justice among them, which thou shalt set before them, besides the ten commands before delivered. They were spoken by God himself in the hearing of the people, these were delivered to Moses after he went up to the mount again, at the request of the people, to be their mediator, to be by him set before them as the rule of their behavior, and to enjoin them the observance of them, in order to which he was not only to rehearse them, but to write them out, and set them in a plain and easy light before them and though they did not hear these with their own ears from God himself, as the ten commands, yet, as they had the utmost reason to believe they came from him, and it was at their own request that he, and not God, might speak unto them what was further to be said, with a promise they would obey it, as if they had immediately heard it from him, it became them to receive these laws as of God, and yield a cheerful obedience to them, nor do we find they ever questioned the authority of them, and as their government was a theocracy, and God was more immediately their king than he was of any other people, it was but right, and what might be expected, that they should have their civil laws from him, and which was their privilege, and gave them the preference to all other nations, Deuteronomy 4 5 to 8.